Hello everybody. Learning software can be really boring, can't it? But it's a necessary evil. No, it's exciting. It can be exciting. I'm here to tell you about a brand new course we've devised. Not just a brand new course, a brand new type of course. It's called Door School. And the first in the series is how to use Cubase. This is a course which is all about making music with the software not learning software for its own sake with millions of menus and um, all that kind of stuff. So this is Door School, how to use Cubase. It's available today and we've got lots more coming. Ah, but we'd like to know from you which bits of software you'd like to learn next. So all you have to do, we're running a poll, okay? So go to the uh, course page, uh, Google Thinkspace Courses, go to the Door School page and there you can vote for which piece of software we do next. So whether you're brand spanking new to Cubase, scratching your head, or whether on a Thursday morning sometimes it feels like you're brand new to it because you've never completely got on top of it, um, or maybe you're you know, using a different door and like more and more composers you're using multiple pieces of software because each one is good for a particular thing. You want to explore Cubase? No better way than jumping in with Door School how to use Cubase. Roll the trailer. Hello everybody and a very warm welcome to Door School. This is not the video equivalent of the manuals. That is not a course in how to use Cubase. We've been talking to you many, many times about speeding up your workflow because the less barriers there are between you and the music you want to write, the better. Each module is very much focused on output. I where you're trying to get to. You know, this is a playground, not a playlist. So you're not just gonna sit there watching our videos. We're gonna give you lots of stuff to do. There's minus one task where we give you half complete project and you then add an extra element in. You're not starting with a blank sheet of paper. It gives you something to work with so you can learn faster and have more fun. There's interactive video. There's quizzes to make sure that the whole thing is sunk in. Cubase has one particularly powerful feature which is called chord tracks and chord pads. Do you see this thing here? Well, some of them are green, some of them are orange and some of them are red. That is telling you how close the next chord is to the one you've got. You can also see it in, in terms of the chord editor or indeed of the circle of fifths so you can see how the whole thing relates to each other. And gradually you'll start to get a working knowledge which will allow you to work as a songwriter, producer, composer, whatever else in Cubase. And before you know it, Cubase will be your best friend. All those jobs that you find yourself doing over and over and over again, chances are there's a button that will do it for yeah. you. And if there isn't a button, you can pretty much create any process. Be, 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 be. Whole project set up because you've got all your keys. Which is essentially set. what I do. Yeah. Set up every project. Yeah. <laughs> this is a good point actually. A good monitoring level, mm -hmm. you should be able to hold the conversation and still hear each other because you'll get a better mix overall. I've got a guitar left and right, so let's put them left and right. Bass always in the center. Okay, so bass does go center even yeah. with vocals. The lower in frequency an instrument is, the more central it should be for a balanced mix. So enough of this. What Waffling on, <laughs> time to get stuck in. Have fun. See you then. So that's Door School, how to use Cubase, available at an introductory price of $59, £49 or €55. Euros. It's available today. You can either click the link in the description underneath or Google Thinkspace courses and go to the Door School page where you can fill in a poll and tell us what software we should be training you to use next. So whether you're brand new to Cubase, whether it just feels like you're brand new to Cubase, or whether you're on another piece of software and you just want to spread your wings and learn more stuff and have fun at the same time, come and join us on Door School. Come and hang out in the Discord channel, have a chat, and uh, we'll um, see you there. So that's all for today. I'll be back again very soon. Thanks for your company. See you soon. Bye-bye.